so I've never ever seen one so I thought I would do a real quick uh, care video on a Cuban boa which is Epicrates and Gulfia. Um, they're the largest of the western boas, they're arboreal so you need to include uh, branches and stuff for them to climb on. This is just a video on how I care for mine. I've never seen any care videos so for me this is like how I think it should be. But if anybody has any other opinions, and feel free to leave it, as long as you actually own one, otherwise I'm just going to tell you to fuck off. Anyway, um, temperature is the most important thing with them, and like I say, they're arboreal, so you need stuff to climb on. Uh, the temperature for the warm side should be 80 uh, degrees Fahrenheit. Cold side should be around 72, but to be honest, this is a tub setup, it's not a vivarium or a terrarium, so we'll pretty much leave the uh, cold side at room temperature. She will circulate throughout the cold side and the hot side to maintain her body temperature. That's just what snakes do, not really. If you have them in something like this at the bottom, which is a 4 foot by 2 foot by a 2 foot vivarium, then yeah, you will need to have like uh, ceramics and whatnot inside to control the ambient air temperature. But it's not a real problem in tubs. But anyway, I'm babbling on. Um, they can take temperatures from the low 50s as long as the day temperature goes back up to the 80s. Uh, like I say, they're the largest of the western boas, they're arboreal. Um, females give birth to 46 young, which are about 3 foot long, so they are really big babies when they're born. And yeah, that's basically it. So I'll show you my boa to prove I've actually got a Cuban boa. How I've got it set up. She's got a lot of plants and stuff to hide in, which I cover in her, uh, that's a hot side hide. Cold side hides a piece of bark. She's got a water dish big enough for her to soak in, though they are, um, they don't require any uh, humidity because they're from a dry desert, uh, not desert region, they're from a dry, like, forested area. I'll just look up Cuba. Google Cuba, you'll see what it's like. It's kind of like a dry rainforest. There's a lot of trees and stuff, but there's not much humidity. Anyway, um, so this is her. She's a little bit nibby, and I'm making this video for uh, people who I'm assuming aren't planning on getting one of these as the first snake, because they're not a good beginner snake. They are a bit nibby. Get a ball python if it's your first one. Anyway, I'll try and handle it without getting nipped. There we go. She's quite a nice snake. I work quite a lot with taming her down, but yeah, that's her. The name's Alice. She's about uh, about three months old now. So yeah, so that's Alice. That's a basic care video. That's how I keep her. If anybody actually keeps ones and have, if anybody actually keeps other common uh, Cuban boys. Has a different setup, then let me know, and I'll think about changing mine to something similar to yours. And but this has been fine. She's had no trouble eating. She eats like a pig. She's had perfect sheds. She craps really well. So as far as I'm concerned, this works really well. But if anybody has any suggestions, like I say, if you keep Cuban boars, then let me know, and I'll try and change it and see if she likes that. So yeah, I'll end the video now. Otherwise, I'm just going to babble on. I think I've covered everything with the temperature, the humidity. Uh, I think the size, when they're adults, like I say, they're the biggest of the western boas, so she'll get around 12 foot. It is a female, so 12 foot, and uh, possibly he's a little bit bigger, maybe he's 13, possibly he's 14 foot. So yeah, you've got to be ready for that. They're not a little boa like a rainbow boa. So yeah, that's it. That's my care video. Bye for now. You gonna say goodbye? Say goodbye to YouTube. Oh, I forgot snakes don't talk. You also try to convert mine to salad, but they just won't eat it for some reason. Oh well, sorry, uh, Peter. And tree huggers, snakes just don't eat uh, salad. So anyway, bye for now.